friends, welcome back to another video. Last time I showed you part 1 of my Geronico bouldering adventure with my friends where we successfully climbed several cool boulders at Sector Deliverance. Today, you're going to see what happens in part 2. This time at Sector Matusalem, where we found some more nice problems to try including this boulder with a sick dino move. Let's start with this V3 overhang route called Galileo Bis. Most of the holes are a combination of edges and in-cut jugs, so it's very relaxing and enjoyable to climb. But the crux is somewhere at the top, where we all had to push hard with our legs to reach far and be able to grab the ledge nicely before pulling ourselves up to the top. The freezing temperature also adds up to the challenge because by the time I'm at the crux, I can't feel any of my fingers anymore. Thankfully, I managed to finish the climb this time. Bianca found herself a project on this V1 overhang traverse called Galileo Left. It shares the same start as the Galileo Bis, but goes all the way to the leftmost part of this boat. Oh, that hold already. Come on. Keep going, keep going. Come on, yeah. Nice. Keep going. Alex. Come on. Keep going. Come on, yeah. Nice. Nice. Come on. Let's go. Nice. And one. Come on. Go again. Go again. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Nice. Come on, go again. I really admire how determined she was in finishing this problem. Very nice. Open hand. Looking strong. According to her, the last move was the hardest part to stick. Nice. Ale, Ale, come on. Very nice. Come on, very nice. You can do it, Bianca. Nice, yeah. nice. Ah! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. Relax, relax, breathe. She probably tried this problem about six times before finally throwing in the towel. Again. Fuck. Again, 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 again. Again, again. Very, very close. Close, close. But that was good. But we're still so proud of you, Bianks. You'll get it next time, no doubt. Why is Grim is here? <laughs> Grim is, where's McDonald? <laughs> Gone. <laughs> Yes, I'm just here watching. I'm that beggar. I'm that beggar down there. What do you want? Money or food or send power? Um, I want extra length for my hand. For extra my arms. length for you. <laughs> or maybe extra height. Here's another V1 problem that didn't feel at all like a V1. Finding the right grip and foot placement are needed to get up on this ledge. After that, it's all jogs waiting for you to finish the climb.
I also tried this problem. I already worked on the hard moves at the middle and even got to the top. But I did finish the climb because I did not properly start it from the ground. And when I tried it again, I couldn't stick the moves anymore. I should have probably just finished the climb even if I wasn't able to connect the set start yet. Oh well. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Party. Yes. <laughs> okay, let's put a solo spotlight on my girl Blanche for a second. Because her performance in this V3 boulder is so inspiring and just beautifully well done. Full disclosure, we all thought she's doing the V5 line here. But we're all wrong. While editing this video, I checked the guidebook for the boulder name. And I realized that the V5 she wanted to do goes totally in a different direction. Wait, wait, wait. So we no. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> 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 Come on. Come on, girl. Sure. Come on. Shout out to who? <laughs> <laughs> and finally, the climb that you're all waiting for. This is Matusalem, just next to Galileo Bis. This boulder has 5 to 7 moves on super nasty crimp holes at a very steep angle. And the easiest way to get to the ledge is to dyno it. But it is also possible to do it statically. Here's Albi, Fats, Love, and Blanche giving Matusalem a try. After a while, only Albi and Fats push through to finish it. Okay, I give up on this. Already! Let's watch Albi climb first. Wow, Amar, Amar! Wow! 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 Come on. Fire? No! Ah. Stupid jump. Come on, 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 Yes! Yes! Nice! 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 Nice!
If you're still here, you're probably waiting to see how you can climb this statically. Well, let my girl thoughts show you how it's done. She applied the same beta like Albi from the start. Then she did a left drop knee from here so she can reach the next hold with her left hand. Then quickly bump to a better, harder hold above it. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> you can work it out. Give yourself some open up, give yourself some space and just pull it. Come on. No no the other way, the, with the right. Come on. I think yeah, my foot was on the right, yeah. Right foot. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Come on, yes! yes. Come on, Come on, Come on, come on, come on, come on, on Push, push, push. It's some push pa. And that's how we ended this epic day here at Kironico. I hope you got inspired from watching these incredibly strong people take on some really, really cool boulders here at Kironico. Because I definitely did. Thank you for climbing with us today. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time, keep climbing, keep adventuring, and I'll see you on my next climb. Cheers!